Welcome back YouTube, Sensei Domino here. Today I'm going to be showing the last group of Perez Steel Baseball Hall of Fame art postcards from the large group of these postcards that I picked up off eBay. This group will be the 12th series through the 15th series. Now I don't have the complete set of any of these series, but I do have quite a few of them. We'll go ahead and start with a couple cards from the 12th series. First, we have Bill McGowan. Next, we have Leo DeRocher, Leo the Lip. And then the 12th series checklist. So I only have the Bill McGowan and the Leo DeRocher. So I'm missing six of them. Next, on to the 13th series. We'll start with Leon Day. Next we have William Holbert. Now, I wasn't familiar with Mr. Holbert, so I'll go ahead and read his bio. So William Holbert, organizer, National League, president, 1877 to 1882, Hall of Fame, 1995. So that's William Holbert. Next, we have Mike Schmidt, in my mind, the greatest third baseman of all time. Next, we have Vic Willis. Bill Foster. Ned Hanlon. And the checklist for the 13th series. So it looks like I'm missing the Richie Ashburn, Jim Bunning, and Earl Weaver. So I have six of the nine. All right, on to the 14th series, starting with Nellie Fox. Next, we have Willie Wells. George Davis. Now, I wasn't familiar with George Davis, so I'll go ahead and read his bio. George Davis, shortstop, active 1890 to 1909, Hall of Fame 1998, career batting average 295, hit 355 in 1893. So that's George Davis. Next, we have Lee McPhail. Joe Rogan, George Brett, Nestor Chilak. He's got a great card in the uh, 1955 Bowman set that I'd love to pick up at some point. Probably my favorite card from this group, Nolan Ryan, Texas legend, baseball legend. I just love the... Uh, the artwork on this card, Dick Perez did an amazing job, absolutely amazing job. It would be, it'd be awesome to get this card signed at some point. Just a beautiful, beautiful work of art right there. Next we have Frank Seeley. hope I'm saying that right. I wasn't familiar with Frank Seeley, so I'll go ahead and read his bio on the back. Frank Seeley, manager. Active 1890 to 1905, Hall of Fame 1999, won five pennants. So that's Frank Seeley. Love that mustache. Next we have Joe Williams. Then the uh, 14th series checklist. Missing quite a few of these. Missing the Lasorda, Phil Necro, Larry Doby, Don Sutton, Orlando Cepeda, and Rob McGowan. And there's that one, two, three, four, five, six of the 16. So I have 10 of the 16. It's not too bad. And the last 
series that they produced. This is uh, series 15. This was produced in 2001. We'll start with Bid McPhee. And I wasn't familiar with Bid McPhee, so I'll read his bio. Second baseman, active 1882 to 1899, Hall of Fame 2000, career batting average 277, hit 355 in 1887. So that's Bid McPhee. Again, love that mustache. Next we have Turkey Stearns. Kirby Puckett. Hilton Smith. And the last one, Franklin A. Steele. Now, I don't have the checklist for the 15th series, so I don't know how many cards are actually in the set, but I, I do have quite a few of them, so that's nice. Anyway, uh, that's the last of these Baseball Hall of Fame art postcards. Hopefully you've enjoyed uh, seeing these over the last uh, probably two months now. Um, I will be looking to uh, slowly complete these sets. So you will be seeing a few more of these in the future. Uh, but until next time, thanks for watching the video, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye-bye.